Welcome back to some more Oxygen Not Included Adventures. You may be wondering to yourself, what the hell happened? Because everything is blank, everything seems to be missing, things have definitely changed from the last time we were here. Uh, so, an update has come out, and the update has added a bunch of new things. And since I didn't get around uh, following my vacation, I didn't get around to re recording, uh, continuing the season. I didn't want to necessarily start the whole season over because I don't feel, feel like we really got closure from the last season. We were at 200 and something cycles. It just wasn't necessarily something that uh, I felt like we were in a good place to end. At the same time, I want to be able to get the new stuff in uh, so that way we can... Uh, you know, explore it. We have oil, we have, I guess, traps or something. Like, there's a lot of stuff I actually, I don't even know. And the reason is simply because, uh, I haven't been following the actual, <laughs> the notes or anything. Because I was too busy decompressing from vacation. Uh, then all of a sudden they're like, hey, it's a new update. And it's just like, oh, well, uh, cool. So, um, God, like, none of these guys are actually very good at doing art. So I'm actually going to turn them all off of that. Because that's just waiting to permanently scar certain areas. Uh... There's a, there's a number of new things. Um, there's, like, rooms or something. <laughs> Here we go, room overlay. Uh, you could actually, when you enclose spaces, it seems that you get a... Uh, this should be locked. Yeah, it's not. Um, it seems that you get a, uh, a bonus to that room, depending on how you decide to actually, like, populate it. Um, so the story is... Basically, we don't know what happened to the last group. Uh, the last group has mysteriously disappeared. And all this stuff was abandoned. Uh, and so we show up. The sculptures have eroded. Uh, back to their, nor their natural stone state. The paintings have... Uh, we'll just say the oil has, you know, faded over time. Uh, but the canvas, made out of a sturdy sandstone, uh, has persisted. The food is obviously not doing well because nothing, no one has cared for them in who knows how long. But the water supplies and all that stuff and all the basic functions still continue to cycle and keep the base populated with oxygen and keeping it clean and all that stuff simply based off of the natural gas systems that were already in place prior to us, um, to us coming, to, to, to us basically having our, our previous colony wiped. Uh, it is a very cool concept, and it was actually created by Inferno, uh, because I asked him to just, yeah, I was like, hey, just take this save and just, you know, hide a bunch of stuff out in the darkness that, you know, I wouldn't necessarily see right away or whatever, um, so I could explore and, and, and find all this new cool stuff, and he was like, sure, no problem, and there were some complications with that, and so that's how we came to this, where he basically created this you know, we're starting anew again. And I'm pretty excited about it, honestly. I think it's kind of neat to be able to step into a half-made colony with all these new things and such. Actually, let me see. Oh, I don't have actually a, I don't even have a computer set up. Um, so yeah, we should, I guess, begin exploring, re-exploring the game. Very exciting. Uh, Clay. Let's see. Our cables are still in place. The natural gas geyser is not really putting out a whole lot. Rising pressure, yeah, a couple little poops here and there. It seems to be, however, enough, at least just barely, to keep our systems running here. Yeah, we actually have a backup here, which is still good. Uh, this is getting pushed all the way through because we have two machines actually pumping through that. Uh, what we probably do is figure out a way to deal with this chlorine, perhaps, and get ourselves down to this, so we can have a second natural gas geyser supplying this area. Then we could just, we could just really just kind of, you know, put a wall here or something like that, and have this just slowly eke its way up. The chlorine, you can see the chlorine actually settles. Uh, natural gas will rise above it, so, uh, we could probably get ourselves down here and cut this off, like just cut through this right here. Uh, get that, uh, oh, it's not bleach stone. Oh, good, that's not bleach stone, that's excellent. Actually, is there any bleach stone down here? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, so we'll, we'll basically repel our way down, 
open this up. Hopefully the uh, chlorine, which is at a very, very high pressure. Uh, oh, good. The natural gas is a much higher pressure. Excellent. So the chlorine, the, the natural gas will actually shove its way up and it'll force the chlorine to push its way down. Um, and then what I'll do is I'll just build a wall right here. So that way we have a nice double, you know, doubling up on the natural gas output. So that way our, we want to keep our pipes as backed up as possible. Even though it looks like they're actually doing all right. But nah, we need, we need to make sure we have an excess of power. And in order to do that, we need to get in here and do a little bit of work. Uh, obviously all of our jobs and all that stuff is all, they're all, it's all messed up. Uh, because the dupes that we're stuck with are basically just random dupes. They're not the people that we initially employed to do all this work. <laughs> they simply are not, so this should be kind of interesting to see what happens here. We'll do a nine. Run this all the way down to here. Actually, we can go a little bit lower. And then uh, we'll have to build another ladder set here. Oh, we had to dig that up. And then, I don't know how much higher we can go on that, but it doesn't matter. We'll just go and uh, uproot this. Balm Lily. Okay, that's new. We'll just go ahead and uproot that and this. And Balm Lily again. Uproot. Balm Lily. That. That's new for me. So, uh, there. And we'll G9 this step right here. That way they can reach it. And that should be good. That should be good. Now, once, now that we're going here... Um... Yeah, obviously we want to keep this thing. What is that? Suffocating? Oh, okay, that's a new sound. <laughs> oh, man, we don't have anything researched. Yeah, we have to use basic. Just straight up basic uh, tile in order to do things. Because, yeah, we have to basically redo our all of our uh, research. Oh, man, we have to redo the research. <gasps> that is painful. A little painful. We don't have any coal, which is fine. I wasn't necessarily worried about the coal. Um... This is on a different circle, if I, if I recall correctly. It's kind of nice that, I, that I've taken such a long break since the last uh, episode, because it kind of wipes my memory of what the hell I had planned and what I was doing. <laughs> Let's see, their stress levels are getting pretty high, but we have this here, so... Uh, we'll make this an, a 9 here. That way they hop on it whenever they need. Keep things going. Frame rate gets really choppy, it looks like, now in this build. When you uh, go to uh, when you go to high speed mode, that dev 10x. That's fine. We'll do that. For, just, we'll try to use that periodically, sparingly. Suffocating. They're suffocating because they're going into the machine area or the uh, the, the natural gas area. Uh, a little worried about the computer. Uh, we need to put it somewhere that we can. Oh, there we go. Easy access to water. Perfect. Yeah, they could go right down here and get water from down here. And then I was thinking we just put this on a trunk. That way we don't have to worry about it um, taking up any... Uh, uh, basically using any power. Oh, wait, we can't use the trunk <laughs> because we don't have it researched yet. All right, well, we'll just do this for now. And then let's see, P9. There we go. That'll get done. How is our little project over here? Good. Now, I, I'm hoping that we don't get an excess of... Oh, we are getting chlorine. Chlorine's making its way into the pipes. That's fine. We'll just have to clean it up. We have a bit of a water build up here. That's going to be a problem. That's definitely going to break through that. Obsidian and igneous rock. Oh, actually, no, that's pretty hard. And abyssalite. Yeah, you know what? I don't think that's going to be a problem, honestly. I think that'll be fine. But we should probably figure out a way to move it sometime soon, because maybe perhaps eventually it'll drip, and then it's going to be a huge-ass mess throughout our entire... Our entire base. Uh, we have that long ass pipe actually hooked up to this that had chlorine in it. Maybe we could actually start backing it up again. We don't have a filter in line here. Oh, we don't actually have re re filters researched. So we're gonna have to do repairs then. That's it, we just have to do repairs. Um, I think probably the best way to get this chlorine, keep chlorine from uh, from flooding that is actually flooding the base with, uh, or flooding this area with, uh, with the natural gas pressure from here. The, again, this will push and it'll create like a natural uh, barrier. And so we'll do that. And let's go ahead and actually G9 this right here. That way we can open that up. There we go. These poor guys, they're, uh, they're suffocating on the way over there. So they're only able, to do, only able to do so much, so much at a time. This is not being built yet because everything else is prioritized. 
Uh, we're doing okay on food. We're actually going to start running out very, very shortly. Thankfully, some of the stuff's actually just growing on its own. Yeah, mealwood seed. Can I do both again? I wonder if they fix that. Oh, because I don't... Wait, I have seeds. I wonder why it's not lead. Oh, because it's red. Oh, damn. The clicking. The clicking sound is due. That's awesome. Yeah, I'll have to let I'll have to let some of these things just kind of grow naturally first, just kind of see what they do because we do have some food coming in at least, and we have the micro musher if needed. Um, let's go and actually break this tile here. We need coal too. This up here is not going to help <laughs> until it fills up completely. We'll have to move this stuff all the way up to the top. It looks like. What is that thing? Fungal spore. Yeah, there's a lot of new stuff, and there's a lot of stuff we didn't get a chance to uh, even explore the last time. Here we go. All right. Research. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There are so many things, guys. Oh, my God. Okay. I would say first thing we need to do is... Well, wait. How do I... Do I have to unlock the next science station, too? Let's see. I don't actually see the other the supercomputer anywhere. Polymer press. I don't even know what that does. We're gonna have to just build stuff. Obviously, oil refinery. We know what that is. I'm good on power for now, but clearly oil is gonna come into play. Heavy. There's the heavy watt wire. Heavy watt joint play. Oh, nice. Oh, that's fucking great. Oh my god. Okay. Um, but power right now is actually okay. Um. Oh, here we go. Advanced research. Perfect. Supercomputer. Yeah, we'll get that done first. And then let's make sure our our top our top men are working on it. Only the best research <laughs> level two. <laughs> oh, here we go. Uh, bubbles, <laughs> bubbles. That's all you. Bubbles will be the only one doing research right now. Everybody else is busy doing things. Suffocating too. We're okay. We're okay. Okay, good. We'll get the ladder built here. Yeah, it's gonna be very difficult for them to make it. And this guy out here is like constantly repairing because the wrong element going into that. Um, I don't have I don't have the means to split it. And I know I know that doing what I'm doing down here will definitely uh, solve the issue. The pressure from this is too great. The chlorine will settle, and I just hope that we don't suction out. So much, uh, <laughs> so much chlorine, so much natural gas that we actually make room for the chlorine to expand. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Once we get to a certain point where we actually are like thinning out the uh, the area down here, the natural gas, then we'll build a wall right here and right here. That would just to seal it off. That way, there's less space. The less area we have, the less volume we have to deal with, um, the easier it will be to. Uh, to exchange gases. There, there's so much stuff you have to do. This thing, I don't know. Unless it's like an artist. That's what I need right now is an artist. We're taking nobody else, just art. And uh, that's none of these guys actually, so we'll reject. Do these guys have names? Joshua, okay, looks like regular names probably. The natural gas gens are fine though, which is awesome. Waiting material, dirt. Yeah, we don't have, we'll see, we have 5.3 tons of raw metal. <laughs> and raw mineral, filtration medium, liquid, da, 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 cultivatable soil, dirt, 59.9. That's tons, I'm guessing, right? It'd be weird if it wasn't. Um, great. So we have enough dirt then. I mean, we have a huge amount of storage here. What is this thing? What is that? Oh, it's a little bottle of carbon dioxide. Oh, let's just empty it out, I guess. It's gonna go poof and just have this like massive gas leak here. The carbon dioxide buildup is getting pretty heavy down here, but that's fine. Oh, this whole area is different now. We'll just say it evolved. <laughs> just naturally. How's this doing? Oh, it's so close. It's so close. Just pop it, man. Just pop it. Actually, I'm not going to worry about this right here. But um, I will. I will tell them to emergency sweep these guys. 
because we're going to have to build a tile here soon. Just cut it. Just just cut just cut the damn thing. Just cut it, cut it, cut it. There we go. Now we're going to see the gas, especially at this speed. Yeah, we'll see the gas just push its way up. Just freaking push its way up. And, um, you know, it's just they're going to take forever to do it. I'm not that worried about that lily, lily bomb, lily, whatever it is. Bomb lily. Yeah, here it comes, here it comes. Beautiful. And we should see the, we should see an offset happen here. Uh, wow, they sh I really should have finished this wall first. Bad timing on my part. It's okay though. There's still a thousand, three thousand grams per. Yeah, three kilograms per brick, four thousand. Jesus. Come on over boys, come on, come on. They keep on killing the germs here. I should pump all the damn chlorine in this room and lock it up indefinitely. They'll never come in here again. Just, just do this thing. Just do this thing. Do nothing else but this thing. Actually, you know what? I know how to make that happen. Build, 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 build. Uh, we'll just... Mmm, no, you know what? Uh, we'll try to disinfect. There we go. And then, then they'll stop running in here just to disinfect and they'll actually build my stuff. This actually isn't that bad of, of a deal here. If we need to get this gas for some reason, we can always just pop a hole here and let it all seep over. Circuits overloaded, high stress. Yeah, people are gonna be very stressed out. Research completed. Excellent, yeah, people are on that. Awesome, let's go and get the next one. What do we have here? Uh, apothecary, nope. Not worried about those things, but look at how they join them together. Man, this is all new to me. Again, like I, I was completely checked out. Um, after vacation, just focus on catching up on any for breakfast and all that stuff and all the photography work and everything. Um, so this is all <laughs> foreign to me. Uh, I guess we should probably go for the heavy wall wire so we could start and start redoing some of the power grid. Um, other than that, I mean, liquid pipe. Oh, no, we, we need some of the basics all the way across the board. We'll just do basics across the board. I'm not worried about building the supercomputer just yet. Oh, these guys. How much is in here? 2,000. We still have an incredible amount over here. I will actually flag the... Or put the, the supercomputer here. Oh, the grid is gone. That's a bug. There it is. Yeah, these guys are constantly repairing, which doesn't help. But yeah, just, just get those things built. We're good, guys. Just get built. There we go. So close. So close. Stress is, is uh, getting pretty freaking high. We're going to need another. There we go. Good. That's excellent. So you see, yeah, the, the, the it's building up like crazy. We should get a massive pipe build up. Beautiful. All right. So we're done with that. That project's over. Let's just go and actually, um, there we go. They won't go in. And actually, even here, we'll just do this. Um, and we could turn on their disinfectant shit again here. Actually, let's see. What does the disinfectant overlay look like now? This is it. Oh, nice. Good, good, good. Yeah, it's going to see through there. That's fine. Slime lung. This is the, the problem area, really. This is clean water. Uh, it's full of food poison. I believe it's constantly depleting. No, it's not. Actually, it's growing. Yeah, yeah it's going to be a bitch. I have to cook all our water and all that. Um, we have to build a... Um, we have to actually build a room here. Let's go ahead and see. Do we have an artist yet? Creativity. Wow, plus nine. There we go. Perfect. Print. Welcome to the party. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and seal this room, and then what we'll get is uh, is yeah, because it has a, a algae deoxidizer here, which we'll have to go farm some algae. It looks like we have algae. Yeah, we do. Okay, we're good. Uh, it's probably low on the totem pole there. Pneumatic door. That, that'll that'll work. That'll be perfect. That will turn this into a room, or at least it should be. It should turn into a room, and she should be the only one. She should be the only one. Doing art. She's not. Okay, good. Yeah, now Lindsay is. Oh, hey, Lindsay. <laughs> like my Lindsay. <laughs> Doing art, huh? Who to thunk? Let's see. The door is done. We need to get the uh, get these two tiles built. Perfect and perfect. Suffocating. No one's really suffocating though, right? Yeah, there you go. 
freaking a steady stream here. We built a, a percolator somehow. <laughs> Just having it slowly condense and fall down in there. We're actually running out of food. Um, we can start using, we can start frying. Oh, what was that sound? Sorry, there's a lot of new sounds here. Um, we can start making some mush fry. Oh, fried mush. Oh, that's the uh, thing. Okay. Um, we can start making mush fry and then, uh, we'll do continuous and then have the mush bar just to, uh, well, I'm sorry, make the mush bar and then fry it in the, in the, in the barbecue here. And what I'll do is I'll just tell everybody not to eat that. So mush bar, uh, right. Yeah. Mush bar. Nobody. There we go. Lice loaf is fine. Meal lice rather. Um, lice loaf, uh, da, 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 mushroom. Oh, we haven't made it yet, so that's why it didn't show up here. Yeah, okay, so once we make it, then it'll actually show up. Um, cool, so that'll get done. And let's see, do we have a cook? How many cooks do we have? How many cooks in the kitchen? And then we have a couple of chefs. Uh, we have Ren. Ren is cooks. Let's go uncheck. And we'll go cook. And Gossman looks like he's a chef as well. Or that he can be. All right, good. And Lindsay should be almost, almost exclusively working on art because we have that much art running around. We'll do sweep and uh, deliver. There we go, because she needs anything. Now, do we get a room bonus for this here? New research tile. Okay, so room bonus, we have no effect. Room size, 120 tiles. Oh, the room size is too big. Maximum so tile size is 64 for barracks. Um, and a barracks with a stamina recovery bonus. I can actually just divide the room in half. Just like maybe cut it right here. So cut this out, deconstruct that building, and then put another wall with um Yeah, that should work. Let him take that down. Boom. And then I guess Meep's gonna go to sleep right now, sure, whatever dude. <laughs> there, this should help. Once we divide the room, then this should probably give us... I think probably one side might be a little too large still. Uh, so we'll maybe have to build another wall. <laughs> Just build a bunch of rooms. <laughs> That's totally fine. Two bunks in each. We could do that. Except for the end. It'd be kind of funky. They'll build this thing first thing in the morning. Let's go, guys. This is going to be the longest episode where we cover the least amount of cycles. <laughs> because it's the first. It's the first episode. We gotta kind of take our time here. All right, here we go. Barracks, perfect. 52 tiles, this one is 64 exactly. <laughs> so we made two barracks, yeah. Stamina bonus, it doesn't say what the stamina bonus is, does it? No, it doesn't, uh, yeah, it looks like it won't, let's see. Uh, sleeping in a bed will restore additional stamina for duplicates if it's located within a barracks. Well, there you go. Um, I have a couple free beds, so let's go ahead and take this one off, Gossman, and put Gossman down here. Perfect. And then this room is not is not quite settled as the apothecary, which I'm guessing is a room type. Uh, med bay, med bay, sorry. Um, sick duplicates assigned to medical beds. Da, da, da. So you need a medical bed, a toilet, one table, no industrial machinery. All right, so no cot either then. Um, one table, one toilet. So it looks like I could actually just get rid of the bed and put a table in its place. Do I have tables unlocked? <laughs> I do not. Oh wait, massage table. No, that's not what I need. Uh, maybe to put it somewhere else under food, probably. Nope. Yeah, I'm guessing I just don't have it yet. Sink, apothecary, med bed, supercomputer, cot. Yeah, it's gonna be under decor or something. Let's go see, actually. Maybe it's something we can unlock on the first tier. It'd be kind of weird if you couldn't. I mean, it's a freaking table. Oh damn, number two. Shit. All right. Well, we'll do this. We'll get there. Then we'll have a proper med bay. What's going on with art? Is art happening? I see one here. I don't see one anywhere else though. Uh-oh. I see a... I feel like that's stretching there. We'll wait till they get to that. No, I have to have them clean this up here. Still running low on food. We didn't exactly. Uh, actually, wait. We need to pee. Yeah, all this, all the, these need to be P9 because the food needs to go in here like ASAP. You can't have them fucking off leaving food on the ground like this. Let's go find Lindsay. Find my Lindsay. There she is. Where are you at? What are you doing? Let's follow. 
Let's get rid of all this crap, dude. This... She's delivering stuff for other people. All right, let's take her off that. We need the, um, I thought maybe she could do that without getting in people's way, but, or without slowing down her progress here, but that's clearly not the case. Uh, wait till that brick has been built. Looks like they're building it now. And then I'll have another to requisition. Come on. Also probably should build a couple right here. Took a bunch of people off jobs though. Let me see real quick. Uh, cook, art, research. Okay, everything's actually fine. Nobody's like, except for Lindsay, which is perfect. This room is doing exactly what I said it would. Look at that, all that beautiful gas. Oh my God, that is so much gas. We are never gonna get through that. Look, the pipes are, the pipes are full. We basically have unlimited power. Unlimited power. I don't actually need anybody right now. Let me see. Athletics, construction, construction, no, 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 we'll reject. And let's go ahead and turn off the pod for now. Let's see, uh, disabled building. There we go. God, we still have that stupid thing down there. I wish I'd get rid of that. All right, first tier is done. Let's get a second tier. We'll get that room finished. We need power for this guy. Uh, let's see. Wire, we'll just plug a wire directly into it. go. Good. Look at her going to town. Got some dudes that are just straight chefing or what? Let's see. Cook. Yeah, they're doing a lot of other crap too though. Let's do this. One guy will definitely only do that. And that's it. Yeah, everyone else can deliver to him. And the priority of this should actually be much higher because we do need to get that food going. Notice we're at 35,000. Two cycles ago, we were at 70,000 or so. Two, maybe three cycles ago. But we, we absolutely need to. Sword's not assigned. Oh, okay, well shit. Uh, yeah, we'll just copy this one. And just, whoop. There we go. This is all growing on its own. I'm not gonna touch it. <laughs> Things are just working. Uh, the back rows uh, is working. The front row is not though. I wonder if that's something they fixed. It looks like they may have. Which would be unfortunate, but that's fine. That's fine. It just still means we have food coming in, which is good. Uh, what other room types are there? I really love this thing. This whole like room type thing. Oop, took a screenshot for some reason. Uh, mess hall, stress relief bonus. Well, we have a mess hall here. What does it want? One table, no industrial machinery. Uh, oh, great. Actually, I could just cut this. I could just put a door on either side and that's going to be great. 64 tiles may actually be a bit more than what we need. Let me see. Do I have... Furniture, put a massage table, we'll put two massage tables down here. Uh, right next to the, in the fresh air room, basically. Um, there's no room for mess hall to latrine. Okay, cool. Um, and then what we'll do is we'll deconstruct that. We'll put a wall over here. Oops, <laughs> not like that. And then one here. Door door and then suddenly mess hall right right guys right 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 am i right the food should be pretty high priority too honestly we should do that fish have a dude that just basically tends to the tends to the crops build deliver mop maintenance aid combat massage cook art compost research hydrofan power disinfect repair i just read it and i just went right over to harvest <laughs> it's so stupid sometimes man sometimes uh, yeah, so we have our harvester. Could be you. Uh, and he could also deliver as well. There we go. And since it's, you know, it's only one guy harvesting, I'm going to lower this down to seven. There we go. Natural gas, plenty of power. Like, again, unlimited power. Absolutely absurd. Um, oh, this thing needs to be cleaned out, actually. Uh. It should only be when you leave, not when you come in. Uh, it's not clean out because this door is locked. If I do this, I should go in there and uh, and do that real quick. Or not, you know, maybe they'll just leave it alone. <laughs> Let's see where we're at here. And 
beds always have to be nine, damn it. We're getting low on food. The harvest needs to happen, man. Is it set to auto-harvest? Oh, it's not set to auto-harvest. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, wait, no, no, the back ones. Disable, disaffect, disable auto-repair. Deconstruct. Hold on. What was I looking at? Oh, man, this is, like, really screwing me up here. This double layer thing. Let's click on the damn plant. Enable auto-harvest. And then I can't, I guess I can't necessarily copy those settings. I could just click on harvest, drag to harvest plants, but... Well, that'll, that'll, yeah, that'll try. I forgot that will set it to auto-harvest. Perfect. There we go. Now we have food coming in. How are we doing on the research? We need 10 more of that one. And is that's not being worked on because waiting for water. And it's also not very high priority for my scientist. So there you go. Art is still happening. Good. Doors. The doors are not happening. <laughs> These fucking guys. Well, this room is probably glowing. Yeah, look at that. Just glowing. S stress is down, which is great. This room should change the second those doors go in. Door one. Door number two. I like how we have a we have a, a little little uh what's it called in here? Just picking up the scraps. Perfect. We have a mess hall. Beautiful. 60 tiles, buildings 19. Awesome. Done. Resources low water. Oh, because this thing has moved down for just a little bit. Okay, so we need to actually kill this. And then, uh, wait, we can build this, right? Yeah, I'm sure we can. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, and then we'll put it a little lower. So let's let them come over here and tear, tear it apart. Good. And then we'll put this thing down here. Like right here. That'll give us our clean water supply. Because it looks like they're not coming down here. Oh, that's right. Yeah, they're not going to come down here because of the uh, bottled water thing. So that's fine. Yeah, I know you guys can't breathe. Oh my god, is it not... Did it plant more? It did, right? Yeah, they're in there. Okay, it's these guys that aren't gonna plant. But these guys... Uh-oh. Some of them are there. I feel like... I feel like we're... I don't trust this. I hate that they all show. Wait a minute. Does that mean there's nothing actually growing in it? It's all growing just in the ground? Because I've seen that happen before. Like just naturally, they just grow. Let's uh, let's go ahead and pop one of these off real quick. We'll uh, deconstruct them. And then we'll see what happens here. Skill increase. Is that really necessary to make that sound? <laughs> Uh, good. Okay. Pitcher pump. Perfect. That'll get the computer working if they're getting it working now. Straight up. Yep, that's what's happening. So, in the, uh, just to stick with the lore, uh, in the time that we've been, this area has been abandoned, for whatever reason, we don't know, uh, the plants have actually planted themselves into the... Uh, planters here, as you can see. So we'll have to make a switch at some point, and maybe we'll try to get another harvest out of it, and then we'll uh, and then we'll do it. But but yeah, that's really funny. So we just need to basically just deconstruct these, and we'll probably just end up building it the right way. I think I don't want to be careful and doing one at a time because I don't want to accidentally click on something like the plants. I know we could set up to we could, I could click on the uh, only select buildings, but still I don't necessarily trust it because these plants have planted themselves and it's very delicate. It's taken thousands of years for it to do this. And so I don't want to mess it up. That's just the whole, that's hilarious. I've seen that before with the, uh, uh, when we did the time lapses on the end of some of the um, older episodes, older seasons, we did the time lapses. I've actually watched seeds go down and then plant themselves in tile. It was freaking bizarre. It took forever too. So it's funny how it just it naturally does it here. Uh, we're stabilized, by the way. We're two, three more, uh, three more, uh, cycles later, and now we're sitting at 36,000, so we've stabilized the, the entire thing, uh, the food supply. Just barely, though. If somebody gets, goes on a binge, a binge eating spree, then we're screwed. How's this going? Almost, almost. We almost got our tables. 
That'll actually be done before the end of the cycle, maybe. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> and we'll make it out of uh, Decor Plus 10. There we go. We'll put it right in here. Right next to the fridge. Build that table. And then I'm going to watch this room turn into a med bay, right? A cheery med bay. And this room, actually, I can block off as well in order to make a latrine. Let's see. Wash station, no industrial machinery. Which, hopefully, that does not count as industrial machinery, but I guess we'll find out. Tile. We'll just go do do And line, basically line it up with this. There we go. Sciencing has been completed. We have a hydroponic farm. What is this thing? Animal relocator. Release trap creatures back into the world. Animal trap captures a living creature for transport. Wow, so we can capture all those. Huh. Have unlimited coal? What can we feed them? We can feed them chlorine. <laughs> Find a way to harden chlorine and then drop it on the ground, I guess. Um, let's see. Let's just go for all the level one shit. Get that stuff done and over with. This has not been running because the pipe is blocked, it says. What is it blocked with? Uh, well, okay, nothing, actually. It looks like a mess. It's a complete mess, the whole thing. <laughs> it's a complete and total mess. What is it even going or coming from? I don't even know. What the hell? Yeah, that's... This system is, is a wreck right now. It looks like it, it looks like I'm missing things or something. Uh, oh, it looks like, yeah, I should connect it here. Let's do that. Let's go up... Uh, do I have pipes yet? <laughs> Basic pipes? Uh, wait, uh, that'd be ventilation. Nope, I'd obviously ventilation's grayed out, so no. Well, that will be then one of the next things that we we mess with here. Let's see, research. Uh, she's about to be done with that. Not, not really, actually. We should just switch it up right now. Just go right down to this. All right. And this is now a med bay. Beautiful. We have some rooms set up. We have some rooms set up. Um, it's not a latrine because the industrial machinery, because the damn, <laughs> because of this. Uh, I can just kill this and then that'll take care of it. Deconstruct that. And then we'll move it over a little bit. And then that'll be that. We do have uh, a means to move it. No, no, we don't. Okay, well, fine, whatever. Uh, we should survive off the, no, we won't. Okay, let's go ahead and cancel. Cancel deconstruct. Okay. We need that oxygen for now. And eventually I'll move it over a little bit. But it looks like we can actually go ahead and slow it here. Let's take a look around. We are in a good place. A good start. We set up all of our equipment up here. We have food that's naturally planted itself. Um, we're going to get pipes going and then we're going to get the get the uh, ventilation back up and online. I don't know how that got, ended up missing, but uh, I probably did something stupid last time. <laughs> uh, we we are actually lo running low on food, but we're going to have another big boost here in a moment. Uh, priority on this should be very, very high. And we need to, yeah, basically we need to grill, grill this shit up as soon as possible. And I think what we'll probably do is actually get another cook on here. We have a secondary cook. Yeah, this guy, Gossman. Gossman could do this. Uh, they could both, I could have them both basically deliver to themselves, I think. That's just probably one thing that they're missing. And that should be sufficient for the cooks. And they'll just basically focus on that for the foreseeable future. Uh, Joshua does a little bit of everything. Why don't you go and also put them on learning? That way we could research things a little bit faster as well. These guys are actually inhaling what? Uh, exhaling. They're fine. Yeah, they'll live. I'm sure the air quality in here is absolutely horrendous. Yeah, there's little pockets of uh, carbon dioxide because this whole area down here is nothing but carbon dioxide. Um, what is this? It's polluted oxygen, okay. Breathable but shit air. And then this over here is working out perfectly. So all of this stuff is actually working out great. I'm very happy with this so far. Lindsay's doing a great job of going around and getting all of the green up. Look at that. Yes, we might. we may breathe some, some life into this back into this uh, forgotten colony soon. Oh, wow. What is this? Oh, wow. I, that's new. Huh. That's a new thing. That is very cool. 
negative decor, negative decor, but in the positive decor, these guys are all negative decor because then, you know what? They don't have snazzy shirts. That's the problem. <laughs> they need snazzy shirts, damn it. Um, so a couple paintings in here will probably make this area a little bit better, I think. And then, uh, and that's it. So, awesome. We're off to a really great start. So, woo! Um, I'll try not to scream in your guys' ear for these because uh, I kind of liked the ASMR uh, week that we had where it was just kind of chill. So I'll do my best not to scream in your guys' ear for the rest of this uh, this season. Um, unless things go horrendously wrong, in which case I might just have an outburst. We don't know. Uh, but that's it. Thank you so much for uh, for hanging out. I hope you guys uh, continue to enjoy the rest of this season. Uh, it's actually giving me some ideas. Getting a save back from Inferno. Thank you again, by the way, uh, for doing this. Um, but getting that save back from Inferno kind of like made me realize, like, wait a minute, I could get... We can have like these... Uh, challenges where one of you guys can make a saved game uh, and then share it with me and then I could basically try to recover from whatever it is that's happening there and we could see what happens like that might be kind of fun um, but that's it so thank you again for all of your continued support and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your nights see ya